glitters over top of these ones maybe to show you what they look like this is Jen ASMR subscribe before you fall asleep right there my lovely lovely these girls I hope be showing you a few polishes that have been sent to me by Born Pretty. I've done a few collabs with them over the years and they usually give a code like Gen 10 or something like that for 10% off etc. Um, I will put all of that information down in the description. Um, this is not a sponsored video but I was Before we have a look inside, let's see what polishes they are. All those spoilers on my nails. <laughs> um, I'm just gonna spend a few minutes making some sleepy cardboard sounds on these little packages. If you can't wait and you just wanna see what's inside, feel free to skip it. Timestamps are down below. Otherwise, We are hopefully 
different polishes. I did not choose the colors. Um, they were sent random, I guess. They sent the ones they wanted me to, to show. I was happy with their choices. So the first one we have here is Glitter Jelly number 7. Look at these bottles. They're new bottles, I think, because I haven't seen them before. I've got like Born Pretty stuff. You can get them on Amazon. Um, sometimes they're like on AliExpress as well, I think. Like you've seen them on like things like AliExpress, Amazon, and they're obviously their own website. Born pretty. So gel, nail polish, UV, and LED soak off 15 mils. Glitter jelly number seven. There are two glitter jellies, and the other ones are milky jellies. Oh yeah, this one is a milky jelly, although, um, I don't know what they mean by milky jelly for this one. The other two, I get it. It's like, they are milky, like whitish, um, you know, milky. But this one doesn't seem milky to me. <laughs> it looks like fake. Like, I don't know what it looks like on yet, because I have not tested this one. Um, but it looks like fake blood in the bottle. Look at that. I mean, it looks amazing. But, like, it looks like fake blood. But we'll get to that. We'll get to the testing part. <laughs> so, yeah, we have Milky Jelly number 13. That's this one. This next one is another one of the milky jellies. And this one is milky jelly number three, which looks like a pinkish purple on the sticker there. The next one is the last milky jelly and it is number one. Milky is like a clearish, milky, um, white. So it's like the most milky, milky one. <laughs> and then, the last one must be the other glitter jelly. Glitter jelly number one. And it is kind of a greenish. Bottles are like um like a matte <laughs> a matte texture to them. You know that texture that matte things have? Glass bottles. That are matte. So yeah, um I use two of these polishes on my nails. I have one at the moment. I did them myself, I'm very proud. So it's Gel X extension and then I've used a builder gel in a kind of um, milkyish white swana and then to um, add a little bit more of an opaque milky um, color I went for milky jelly number one as the color, like the base color but it was on top of an already kind of milky builder gel so there we have it it is a milky I just didn't want, like, the fact that these are not my nails, like, the, the Gel X, like, obviously the color change here. Um, I just didn't want that to show because they were clear, um, like, gel tips. I wanted, um, a touch more opaque on the jelly. Wait. We have this one. I think I did two coats. Two coats of this on a milky builder gel. And then what made this gorgeous sheen on my nails here? Can you see that kind of pinky blue purpley sheen there? Oh, gorgeous. That 
is the Glitter Jelly number 7 and I just did one thin coat to kind of get that glazed look. I was going to try out more than one coat but I just thought one coat was so subtle and gorgeous. There we go. Can you see that? Look at that. Isn't it beautiful? Oh, that is mermaid in a bottle. So what I'm going to do now um, is I'm just going to go through each of them and I'm going to just do a little tapping and scratching and chatting with each of the bottles and then I'm going to overlay some swatches of them. Okay. So start with the milky jelly which we just saw on my nails <laughs> so yeah it's just a white milky jelly what can I do can I do like um maybe I'll paint one layer two layers that sort of thing one two three layers to show like how transparent or how opaque they are so yeah milky jelly number I wonder how many there are in general. I'll obviously link them down below, but I didn't check how many there were. So that's Milky Jelly number one. Now on to Milky Jelly number three. Is this kind of pinky purple? And I was surprised by the color because it doesn't look like the sticker. Well, it doesn't look like it's gonna look like the sticker, you know what I mean? Maybe it will, like, later, but it looks very different to me. <laughs> like, that looks Barbie pink. <laughs> the sticker does not look Barbie pink. Hold on, double the focus. There we go. So, yeah, that's not the same, is it? <laughs> but, yeah, a very, like, Barbie pink jelly that looks like it's gonna be very pretty like especially in like the jelly form so it's gonna be like a little translucent we will see we will see I will swatch one two possibly three layers we'll see I'll do a little test nail for you so you can see so you can see And I guess I will um, put the glitters over top of these ones, maybe, to show you what they look like. I'll do that after I'm showing the glitter ones. So milky jelly number one, two, three. <laughs> and then milky jelly number 13. This is maybe the one I'm most excited to see swatched out. Like, this is blood red. <laughs> I think that either it will look just normal, like just a red polish or something, or it's gonna look so cool. Like, very vampy. I know, vampy. Blood red, but... So yeah, milky jelly number 13. 13, 13. Is it just gonna look dark, or is it gonna look I hope it looks vampy. And I was thinking, oh, maybe I could use these on Halloween nails, you know, like I could use it to do like a drip and cure it before it like evens out and it would just be like a little drip of blood on the nails. That could be fun. Definitely keep that in mind for Halloween time. Okay, so on to the glitter jelly. Obviously, we have seen the glitter jelly number seven on my nails. Like so. But we haven't seen it with more than one coat, so we'll see after. So this is glitter jelly number one. 
and it is green, look at that it's like a greenish glitter, does it have like a it doesn't seem to have like um you know the other one has like a pink and blue like sheen to it, this one just looks green green mm, maybe yeah gold, it has like a gold hue to it yeah, the glitter is gold, you can see. So maybe the gl it's the glitter in there, the one that's giving that pink and blue hollow kind of effect. But this one is gold. Goldy one. And then again with the number seven. I'll maybe just do one with a few extra layers to see how much it can build. How mermaid -y. I don't know how it looks yet. I'm doing it later, so <laughs> we'll see. Okay, so that is all my swatchy testing. Pretty fun. I thought just before I go though, I'll show you what else I did to these nails after just using the polishes. I used these and these. Just thought I would show you the charms I used. So these are the hearts I used. You can see kind of pink with a touch of glitter, like a bluish glitter, but like on the nail you can kind of see the pink kind of sheen to it, but because the rest of my nail has a pink sheen to it anyway, kind of looks like it was just the polish that did that. <laughs> and I just use the medium and small ones, the big ones are just a touch too big. Like, Got a whole bunch of nail supplies from Timmy. And then these ones are the little water droplet kind of pearl, half pearl ones here. And they have like all different colours running through them. I guess that's just on the back, transparent, and then the backing is white on one side and then different colours on the other. Like reflective. So yeah, I use these pearls and not the big ones, not those big ones, but a few different sizes, small and medium. Small, medium, no. Small, let's go medium, small, extra small. And I popped those on with this Born Pretty Nail Rhinestone Glue, which I actually got from Amazon before Born Pretty asked me if I wanted to try out their jelly polishes. So that was a nice little coincidence. <laughs> so yeah, this is pretty good. Um, it's got it's all kind of pointy opening there, so you can be very precise with it. Pop it on, etc. Um, I've seen other people use like poly gel and stuff like that, whatever. Other types of um, gel to glue things on, but this one seemed to pretty practical to me. 100 and seconds for a UV lamp and 60 seconds for lead. Lead is way better. LED, sorry. In French we just say lead. So in English LED. So yeah, that was pretty cool. I'm pretty happy with my nails. I'm pretty happy with the polishes. And I'm really excited to see if I can make some bloody Halloween nails. <laughs> I'm thinking this pink, I'll be able to do some cutesy nails with them. The milky white will definitely be useful for anything, basically, for lots of different styles. And then those glitter, glitter ones, oh, so pretty. And these um, glitters are no white. There was no sticky, um, sticky residue after them, so I'm wondering if they're supposed to be like as a top coat. I put a top coat on on top, um, an indigo one, but um, yeah, I wonder if they're just like toppers. I didn't notice if these had a sticky residue or not. Try and think back. I don't know actually. 
I didn't think about it, but these definitely don't. I was surprised. Okay. So, that is everything I have to show you guys for this evening. I hope. something with these gels now. Like I used to get certain gel polishes a while back, like a few years ago, and I'd be like, thanks, <laughs> that's cute. Maybe I'll try and make some press-ons or something, but like, no, I'm like, yeah, let's do this. <laughs> it's fun. I'm not at the stage where I can film myself doing my nails yet. I'm still a bit like, it takes too long and it's like, uh, frustrating and I'm not wanting the extra stress of having to make sure I'm filming it correctly and stuff. But one day, I will do, like, do my nails with me videos at some point. I really like those videos, it's relaxing. Yeah. Okay. So. No. Glitter jelly number seven. See you next.